Hi, I'm Revel, and people are constantly telling me how much they hate to cook and they can't do this because it takes so much time. So I've chosen to do this video to show you how little time it really takes to make a really healthy, delicious, fulfilling meal in about 12 minutes or less. And uh, I'm going to set a timer and begin. Now look at People will go to drive throughs and they will spend about that much time in a drive through getting crappy food that they're going to be sorry they ate later. Okay, so let's begin. I'm going to set the timer and make it happen. First thing I do, I've got a no salt added can of pinto beans here. And if my everything works right, I shall open that. I'm going to pour the water from the pinto beans right in the skillet. There's enough fluid in there that I do not even need to add any more water. Then I'm going to take some mushrooms. I turn the heat up right now, it's on high. Mushrooms contain a lot of nutrients. I never liked mushrooms until I started making them myself. To me, raw mushrooms taste like dirt. But you should always at least steam your mushrooms, if nothing else, because uh, my understanding is they all contain some type of carcinogen. So just to be safe. All right, so I'm going to add some curry. Never liked curry before I started this either. So that's heating up right now. This is some garlic herb salt free dressing from, uh, not dressing, but spices from Spice Hunter. And I know some of you are asking, oh, is this all organic? No, nope, it is not. But if you can get all organic, go for it. All right, so we're going to throw the mushrooms in there. Let everything heat up. Helps to have a cover on the pan. What the cover does is it helps it heat faster and keeps the retains the heat, of course. So we're at two minutes right now. You can see everything's getting covered in curry going to be really good. Oh, I almost forgot my onions. Got to have onions. I was never an onion fan either until I started this food program. So let's turn the heat down. No need for heat that high. Chopping up my mushrooms. They're in the pan. Let them cook. Just not long. It's funny, I've seen recipes recently since I've been checking recipes out and they're saying cook your onions and mushrooms for 20 minutes. That's ridiculous. You don't need to cook these things for 20 minutes. Okay, so I'll keep it moving so nothing burns. I've got it down about halfway right now. It's medium heat. Then I'm going to turn in, this is a Cruciferous Crunch. It's from Trader Joe's. I use a lot of Trader Joe's things. Cruciferous are very, very, very healthy for you. So I'm just throwing them in the pot or in the pan. And then I'm going to throw some, this is greens for cooking, also from uh, Trader Joe's, kaleidoscope chard. I've gotten to like a lot of greens that I didn't like before. So what else can you put in here for greens? You can put in some uh, Brussels sprouts. You can put in, this is kale I'm putting in right now. It's also greens for cooking from Trader Joe's. These are mostly organic. I get as much organic as I can, but sometimes it's just not, it's just not feasible. They're just not available. Now see how high this is? I'm just going to cover it. And that's my bird, just fell off her uh, perch. I think she'll be fine. So while that's happening, I'm going to put these back. So you can clean up too. My uh, mushrooms, what I'm not eating, are going back, or what I'm not using. So you can clean up, that's how fast this is. You clean up while things are cooking. Now you don't want to overheat or overcook. Let's move this because it's plastic. And let's mix everything up. 
actually like a bigger pan, but this is what I've got left after our move. You just want things to wilt. You don't want to, you don't want them to get all soggy. Soggy, not good. So you want them to turn nice and bright green and just get wilted. You see how, how much smaller they are now in the pan. Okay, we've done four and a half minutes. So I'm gonna put the cover on and let it steam for maybe another 30 seconds maximum. Here's my bowl. Put away the can opener. Wash this. That's done. Put the chart away. Grab the kale, put that away. Check this again, we're done. See how bright that is? That's beautiful. Okay, so now what I do is I just turn this over. So all the seasonings are on top, they cover everything. You can see the mushrooms and the onions. What about the beans you say? Let's throw some beans in there. We're just gonna heat them up, pan's already hot. Doesn't take much. While that's happening, I'm going to cut up some fresh vegetables. You can use anything you want here. So now people say, I've heard that it's better to cook uh, tomatoes. You get more of the nutrients out of them. So, How about we throw some, just heat them up for a minute. I'm gonna turn the heat off. I sometimes forget to do that, which is not a good thing. I'm gonna dump everything into the bowl. Isn't that pretty? I'm moving faster than my cameraman can move because we didn't, we didn't um, rehearse this. Okay, it is seven, uh, seven minutes so far. So I'm trying to show you how fast and easy cleanup is. Now I've already ground these. These are chia seeds. They add some omega-6s, which is a big deal right now. And I'm going to add um, some sunflower seeds. A lot of people are trying to stay fat free. That makes no sense. Your body needs fat for the vitamin, um, to assist vitamin A, D, and E. So, because your body will not assimilate fat without fat in your body. So that's pretty much it. I'm going to add a little bit more of the garlic herb. It's called garlic herb sensation. Doesn't even sound good, huh? If you like garlic, I do. And we are done at 7.53. So that's all you need to do. I'm almost cleaned up. All I need to do is wash that pan, this, the bowl, and the fork, and I'm done. So let me share some, uh, some uh, options for you. As people tell me, well, I'm, I get bored with that. Well, the thing is what you do is you change the variations of the greens. There are so many greens out there. The other thing you want to change is um, your beans. You got black beans, red beans. Uh, I used pinto today. There's a variety, probably six or eight, I don't know how many beans are out there. Get a variety of greens and beans, um, different kinds of tomatoes, different kinds, like I also have this beauty that I could put in there as well, and gives it color. The more color, the more you want to eat it. I have people who see my stuff on Facebook and uh, Revel's Fitness Journey on Facebook, and they say, God, you make the best looking salads. Well, I do. <laughs> you know, and pretty makes you want to eat it. So thank you for joining me today. And uh, I'm Revel of BodaciousLiving.com and also ResponsiveLifestyle.com. I have a 21-day weight loss health gain, which is most important, program on ResponsiveLifestyle.com. Join me there, will you? Thank you.